Hello, everybody. <laughs> um, it's been a while. Yeah, it has. It's been a really long while. Um, but it's been good. It's been good. No I got news, some show no and tell. No news is good news. I have show and tell. What are you show and telling? Well, what the heck? You can't see it. Oh, them. no, I didn't see you that. Didn't you see that? Mm-hmm. Ellie's seeing, and then here's the big one. This is uh-huh. easier to see, I think. A little bit. Whistler Hella Skiing. Whistler Hella Skiing. And you only get this stuff if you actually, if you actually go, go. I didn't get one. And you last. Yeah. Not like th- <laughs> three of the mm-hmm. six other people that were with us bailed, didn't make it past the first half of the first run, and the helicopter actually had to come back in and get them out of there because uh, they That's were. That's why I didn't go. They were holding. That would have been embarrassing. You would have. It would not have been good. Or deadly. And actually, it's not true. You can buy these anywhere you want to, but. Legit, you know, you but legit. they didn't have to go through if you just go by it the what 45 minutes of avalanche survival training, the avalanche survival training, yeah, no. and um, how, to, how to find somebody in an avalanche and what to do if you get in an avalanche, yeah. how to try to avoid skiing out of an avalanche, no. and the, the helicopter, too, getting your head, get, cut, get off. Your head cut off by that, or oh, it catching on fire and the fire extinguisher. Don't bother trying to put out the helicopter because it's got so many tons of. Gas fuel in that's it. That's useless. It's, it's actually for putting people out. Yeah. So it's just like, yeah, put the person out and then just don't worry about the helicopter. Oh, okay. Jesus. Back yeah. to Hella, no. No, it wasn't. On the hell's game. It was. Yes, yes, it was easy. Gavin it, went and he slayed it. He killed it. Hi, he Carol. Um, see you soon. Gavin was dying to go. He wants to, He wanted to do two extra, three extra runs. Oh, my runs. God. He didn't want that. It, it was incredible. It was perfect snow, two, two, two and a half feet of untouched snow. We're going to post pictures. Ooh. I just haven't had a chance. It was like floating. Literally, it was like floating on air when you got on that smooth snow with a good pitch and you just kind of dance, you kind of bounce, bounce to Touched one. Did. And bounce. You, you danced and you bounced. Did. You did, you bounce. Yeah. No. Keep the tips, stay up because the skis are so wide that they just float in the snow. And the snowboarding, Gavin was just killing it. It was, uh, it was incredible. The whole trip was. The whole trip was really good. Incredible. Mm-hmm. Snowed. Oh my god! It's probably two and a half feet of snow. So amazing. From the time we got there to the time we left, and um, it was powder mm-hmm. like crazy. So, Whistler, shout out to Whistler. They, it was good. They were awesome, and the snowmobiling too. Wow, that was my favorite. Oh, well, I know it was. It's a foot of snow, fresh oh snow. Oh my god. Mm-hmm. We were so the first awesome. tracks out. Mm-hmm. Gavin tipped over his. He did. Right after they were talking smack about me. Yeah. About me. And then the Can't instructor. Can't believe you haven't turned it over, Mom. <laughs> then the guy d- dug his in a ditch when he was trying to it was, carve it was a brand new patch kind through. Of and amazing. That was so. You'll see some of those pictures too. Yeah. Sure post. I'm gonna try and put a little video together on the hell skiing stuff. Yeah. It's hard to that. still grasp it, even though I've seen the pictures and the video. I still am like. Mm. Don't really get the feel of it, the sensation. You, you can't. It's very hard to. All right. Anyway, <laughs> we had to keep up with Duncan. Hey, yeah, he was Duncan wondering did, where are my people. Great. Duncan's no, remember when really they good. went? When Nick and them all went out with Duncan, and they're like, "What?" Duncan's like, "Zoom, zoom, zoom, zoom." Oh, that's right. Yeah. And, he, and he's even better this year. Mm-hmm. I'm glad he did. He did a day of lessons, and um, that helped get him. In, in gear and he was he, he was paralleling I think maybe better than Beanie and Jake yeah I was sure he was going to fall on a tree well going through the blades yeah oh yeah there's a lot of tree well stuff yeah anyway he does like to fall so so oh Jakey just texted night mom I guess I'm not going to text him back no um okay so that was awesome how have you been feeling off of chemo and radiation and all such similar like really kind of, uh, um, like obviously all the stomach aches pretty much went away. I realized, you know, um, the no eating thing was helpful with the chemo. And the chemo, <laughs> Just I didn't have to worry about that anymore. In the morning, I didn't eat when I took mm-hmm. chemo. And at night, no, it wasn't at night. It was only in the morning. I can't remember. You only took it in the morning. Morning, yeah. So, yeah, I've been feeling awesome. Um, the workouts were legit. They got me where I needed mm-hmm. to be. I didn't bomb at all. Mine got me where all. I needed to be, too. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't work out. Two days of skiing. Nice job, honey. I skied three. Did you? 
The third day. Oh, yeah, you did Mofo. Oh, three's good. Three's uh, legit. That's good. That was legit, for that God's was, sake. That was good. Actually, much better than I mm. would have expected. Because it's deep snow. It was not. I know. It was hard. It's fun, though. What, did you like it? She She's a little uh, off. I miss Keith in three years. Yeah, that's true. That's true. She would have liked more that's brooms. That's Big, wide blues, yeah. right? I don't need to be run over by people. these. And these are aggressively rated, too. The, the blues were mm -hmm. ugly and, and steep. And, you know, some, hey, there you go. Underwear boy. Mm -hmm. You want know, to you know, come live? You want to go Facebook live in your underwear? You can't even see me. If you go well, they did when your butt was for it. <laughs> and your crack lacquer was showing. Come here. Say hi. Hi. Bye. <laughs> go to bed. Um... Okay, anyway, on with that. Yeah, so it was, so, it was awesome. And feeling so, feeling good. Feeling good. Um, workouts were, were uh, legit. Ron and Agostini kept me going, and legs were in perfect shape, and still feel great. Don't feel like, uh, you know, I got any issues until, you know, tomorrow. <laughs> I'm so nervous about tomorrow. I'm dying. I'm dying inside. I wasn't going to drink, and then we went out for dinner, and I had a drink. Well... I've gone three days without a cocktail. Three. That's really right. good. It's impressive. Uh, um, so <laughs> that's how we do it in Canada. Like I said, it was Leah, pretty amazing. Leah, it was mm -hmm. incredible. And you we guys, thanks, uh, Uncle John, Aunt Marianne, and Leah, and Brian for the... Uh, <laughs> the room. Uh, the, yeah, it was, <laughs> the, they were... The accommodations. Accommodations were great. Food in Vancouver was awesome. Good recommendations. and. Mm -hmm. Um, and having Lisa and her family out there was awesome. My nephew Matthew's just slaying it on skis. Uh, fun to see everybody out there skiing and having fun. Yeah. So um, back to reality. I'm back to Oops, reality. There goes gravity. You know, Eminem. Oh, no? that didn't sound like Eminem, but well, I, okay. I um. <laughs> You think because you got this whole vibe going on, you can be vibe. like all white Oh, I got a new, do, do, do I do this shirt now sure. or later? So my other show and tell. This is probably um, my favorite uh, kind of Sia, oh, not Sia, cancer, <laughs> cancer shirt cancer. that I got. No, yeah. Yeah, I do. Yeah. I didn't want carrier for Sia. Does that count? No, I, I don't really. think so. Not really. Um, so my volleyball team got these t-shirts. <laughs> I think you guys saw them, but I'm wearing them today. Look what Larry's self wrote. Thanks, Larry. <laughs> You're a handsome so, bald effort. There's a, the Rockets. That's our team. And I don't know if you can see the back. If I can oh, it was so cute. I'm going to read it just I, in case. They, uh, Baker, work hard, play harder, fight, little cancer symbol, hardest, win for John. Hashtag win for John. How adorable is that? So that was our little, my little 10 year old so team. Cute. And uh, um, the, one of the moms has a t shirt business. and and got them all for the team and then they wear them at practices and stuff and so uh, uh, they are they are um, actually she said if, if anybody wanted one because we had a couple of people and we posted it last time said oh I want one so she said no problem just send them my you know my email address and, mm -hmm. and she can get it squared away yep um, so cute um, and tomorrow yeah. Tomorrow's an MRI. I was reading a book, what they call it? PMS. Pre MRI syndrome. Oh yeah. <laughs> Pre MRI. Yeah. So they we go do the MRI, they'll do a um, with contrast and without contrast and see what's going on in the in the noggin and if there's any regrowth, um, it'll it'll will, would probably show up, I'm guessing. Especially on the on the uh, Yeah, it'll show up. Mm-hmm. And um, so we go do the MRI. We won't get the results. We get a disc. And I'm not going to look at the disc. What is NED, Kelly? One word. N-E-D for tomorrow. Uh, I don't know. Um, yeah, so you're going to go down. You're going to go get the MRI. I'm going to go to a CF meeting with Scott and Molly. And then we're going to meet up. You may or may not have the no, results. I won't have any results. They're going to give me a disc. God. And we take the disc to Duke the next day. Duke will will look at it now. I, I reached out to my uh, radiologist and, and asked her if she would mind, you know, looking at him uh, oh, tomorrow. Oh, no afternoon. evidence of disease. Oh yeah, yeah, Kelly, that's it. No evidence of disease. I like that, Ned. 
And um, hopefully she'll call. We're, we're on the road. We'll have a six hour, five and a half hour drive up to Duke. Um, and we'll uh, we'll probably stay at the swanky place that, that was pretty my nice. friend from college, Diane, um, hooked us up with last time. Um, mm -hmm. And then go in eight o'clock and they do some blood work, blood testing and stuff. And see where my white blood cell count is and red blood cell you count. You need to donate some platelets to I you. might need platelets. Yeah, my platelets are, are low. I'm and not giving you a liver or anything because I, I might need it yeah, eventually. You, you, I don't want your liver. Your liver's probably not <laughs> in the best shape. I'm just saying. I almost came out my nose. Maybe Gavin's liver. <laughs> no, oh, probably no. not good. <laughs> Beanie. Beanie will give me a liver. Beanie. <laughs> oh, my God. Anyway. Her season's about to start. You can't give me a liver. No, no, she can't. She no. can't give me a liver. Um, yeah, so how are you feeling? I know I'm feeling anxious. I was saying I, today my anxiety level's at 100%. Is it? Yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah. So mine's Pretty not, high. so I feel, and I, I wrote this to, I think, Lisa Ruaga. I, I don't feel anxious. I don't feel concerned. Um, That's good. No, I don't. I feel like this, this, it'll be clean. I feel like it'll be good. The blood work, we'll see what happens with. But part of it is that that it's 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 like look I've done whatever I can we did I'm, we did the radiation we did the chemo I've been eating well I've been doing everything exercising all that stuff younger it all points to things being okay. I agree. However, sometimes they're not right, right? Sometimes my the the feeling that you've got. And the, I don't have a feeling. I don't want you to think that because I have a very no no no. It's not I your feeling. I'm talking about my feeling. I know, but. You know my gut instinct is usually on, and I'm not saying my anxiety is high because of a gut instinct. I'm saying my anxiety is high just because it gives you a peak. It is. Well, it is. It's, it's a peak a, inside, it's, it and does. that's just like we said it before. It's just like when the boys get a throat culture or bronchoscopy or our even x-rays. Because yeah. when you can see the webbing of the lungs and you can see all that's that, true. it's like a it's like, ugh, reality yeah. and I mean, I can have all the energy in the world. I can yeah. feel great. I can, you know, have positive attitude and yeah. everything is great. And then one picture can yeah, turn it, it into, you know what? Your, all that good stuff is, is, was just kidding you. It's just because it's not, you don't feel it yet. Right. right. So. Uh, it's but, not going to be that. No, but part of me, not I think part of me is, is like, look, even if there is regrowth and then we've got a, a, a kind of a plan B. And we got a plan C. We do. We kind of plan have a plan D, and we got lots of kind of lots of weapons to still we go do. after and use. Uh, we don't like to use the strike, though. You know. <laughs> oh, we don't want to use that strike <laughs> yes. already. Did I? I said strike already. No, oh. I said we don't want to use that. Oh yeah, already. exactly. We don't want to. We'd like to push that out forever, maybe. Could get get the momentum going good. in the right direction. Forever would be good. But if if it is, then we still have, you know, a lot of other things that, that uh, mm -hmm. we got up our sleeve. And Duke, I think, is um, uh, very progressive. They know what they're doing. They, you know, they've got a lot of access to studies and things that are going on right now. Um, speaking to a a, a a a guy that is now a friend that you know was diagnosed four years ago and had no regrowth for like three years, and then. Had regrowth and he was at Duke and they put him. Yeah, in the no, you regrowth for three years. Three years yeah. After just chemo and radiation. Yeah. Wow. And of that. course, herbs and. <laughs> he does a lot of. He does herbs. a lot. He does herbs. <laughs> he does herbs and, he does and he does meditation. He does yoga. He's good. And, you know, um, but I got my Reiki master too. So. You do. Not everybody has that. So he went to Duke. He got the polio vaccine injected in, and all of his. Oh, his talk about that for a second, because that shocked me. Like how they do it. I was picturing it was going to be like vaccines like no. you're getting. So this polio vaccine, polio, it's not polio vaccine. I'm well, you know, vaccinated for all vaccinated or most mm -hmm. people only, for polio. So our bodies already have that in our system to kind of fight it. What they do is if you regrow this polio study, they went in and they basically, they, they drill a, head, a hole in your head and then they take the polio vac uh, virus and they inject it into the tumor. So the virus, like directly the actual into the virus, tumor. right like, into your right. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. That did not hurt. Well, yeah, stomping me. She <laughs> always beats on my scar, right? Uh, so anyway, that that's what they do. And he said that the 
you know, he looks at the MRIs and his MRIs look like old Pac-Man had been eating out yeah, yeah. cancer. Yeah, just since the polio. Yeah, virus so this is the injection. regrowth. And then Crazy. The, yeah, so there's, oh, yeah. you know, there's a lot of stuff that uh, that's out there and, you know, we're going to try it all. Listen to, look at Lisa. John is not describing what he's doing now. This is a regrowth study. Yes, it's a regrowth study. We're talking about what, what Bob right. had done. Yeah, you guys, you know, yeah. if you come in late to the conversation, or maybe yeah. I missed it. So yeah. <laughs> look at Steve Heyman. So it's, it's a hell yeah, of a science fair project. Yes, it is. Yeah. So that's, that's, that's what I was saying is only if, if I had regrowth, there's mm-hmm. lots of other options are available. That polio thing, maybe, maybe not. It's still a trial. Um, but there's, there's tons of other stuff. Yeah. So hope for the best tomorrow and we're prepared for the worst. We're not really prepared for well, the worst. Well, we know, but we're But we do close. have backup plans. Yes. Yeah. All hope is I might, I might be flying a lot, but at least they're <laughs> already, try, already trying to get me up to, up to Massachusetts. Uh, for Dana Farber, yeah. you know, and out to California, there's a there's a, a doc out there that we wanted to talk to. Uh, it starts the whole process over. Yeah. Which whatever. Um. So then Duke, we're gonna go to Duke. We're gonna have this screen. I say we because I'm going, but <laughs> not not getting screened. No, you're not. I'll support you though, honey. So nice. <laughs> oh my god. Anyway. Um, yeah, so that's it. I mean the the, the Duke I think they'll they'll check the blood, see if the there's regrowth, check the blood. <laughs> Look there, it? And find I I can't I can't read shit right now. How long do I feel like Oh yeah. <laughs> so the um um, if everything looks good, then they uh, sign me off. I sign the contract thing, and I and I go back on. Uh, yeah, when does when does it all start? I, I was trying starts, to remember that. Like, I think okay, it starts that you day. do. S- yeah, we go. We're gonna go on either a five day of. of wait, 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 whoa, 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 whoa. We go on. Screening we, is. Screening is tomorrow, no. and yes, Thursday. Thursday. Mm-hmm. And then we go, then we go back on chemo. Starting Thursday. Starting Thursday, and then we come back like three weeks later. And we do the injection on the 23rd day of the 30-day cycle. And we're either taking, oh, we're either taking it for five days or we're taking it for 21 days or 23 days five. on a 30-day Wait, cycle. Wait, is the five a megadose? The, no, the five is actually the normal thing. And the 23 or whatever, that's the one where they up the, maybe? the chemo. I don't know. I was taking it every day. Hopefully it's just the one. The little one. Well, but whatever. Um, okay, so then you'll be back on chemo as of Thursday, as long as you pass the screening. That's my understanding. Okay. Did not realize that. Um, okay. Well. I think that's it. That's it. Except that we did realize that we said we were going to cheers at the end of radiation. We had such a big day that day, which was amazing. But um, So we forgot. We had a video about it though, and we did get to ring the bell with you guys, so that was cool. We just didn't cheers. So, do you think we're gonna tomorrow night? We won't know the results unless Doctor Eaton calls us. They right. won't. We won't know the results of the MRI. Mm-hmm. Well, well, maybe. Uh, well, maybe what? Maybe we'll know if Doctor Eaton. Reads if Doctor Eaton calls. If Doctor Re- Eaton reads it and lets us know, we will come back tomorrow. <laughs> When we get to, where's Duke? Wilmington? No. <laughs> Wilmington? I was talking to somebody from Wilmington today. <laughs> um, Chapel Hill? <laughs> we will call, we will, we'll see how it goes tomorrow. We're just and then, gonna say and, Duke. And then we'll be, we'll be at Duke I'll on go to geography. Thursday. And then we drive back. Mm-hmm. So, so um, yes, but if we find Durham. out, Durham, yes, yes, you are correct. Um, and Raleigh, Raleigh, Durham. So if we find out anything, we will definitely come on and let you guys know tomorrow night, and then we can do a proper cheers, because I'm bringing a bottle of wine. It's going to be red. Can't drink white. You I'm love so- white. <laughs> 
It's gonna Just be kidding. Fun. Don't send any white. She won't drink it. Um, and if not, I, I don't think know. everyone knows it's Durham. Everyone's everybody <laughs> except me. <laughs> I did know it. It just wasn't there. I know. I, I have those moments. In my head. Um, and then that's it. That's it. So I guess <clears throat> intentions. We haven't set an intention for a while. I have. I'm talking about like oh, for, everybody. Oh, for everybody. Health and happiness. Uh huh. Health's been my meditation one. Happiness was covered <laughs> in a ski trip. What you look, why aren't you looking at me like that? Where do I fall into all that? What do you mean? I'm doing an intention for me. Health and happiness. You're very self-absorbed. Really? <laughs> this is what you say to me? <laughs> it is. Anyway, I gotta go to bed. I'm so tired. I say that a Let's lot sign in these off. videos. These people go anyway, we have to say what the intention is. The intention is clean x-ray. Oh. Ned, oh. as Kelly said. Ned. Oh, no. What is it again? Ned. No evidence of disease. Ned. No evidence of disease. Pure, clean MRI. Mm -hmm. However you want to say it, that's what we're putting out into the universe. So everybody, put that, put that out there. No evidence of disease. Clean MRI. That's what we're going for. That's what we're going for tomorrow. And if we find out, well, we'll have to update either way. Sure. But hopefully we know tomorrow, because I don't think I can wait until Thursday. Yeah, well, we'll see. I mean, I, we don't, you know, I'm not going to look at that damn thing. I can tell you that right now. Fuck no. Yeah. So, signing off. See ya. Fingers crossed. <laughs> all, the good people, all that good stuff. Good intentions out in the universe. Good intentions. <laughs> Magical. Thanks for signing <laughs> in, guys. <laughs> Bye. Find finish because we haven't done this for a while. Bye.